All right, hello everybody, and welcome to the channel. As usual, my name is of course Constantine, and today in the world of indie games, we are just about to check out a brand new game called Creatures of Ava. And this is a game I'm super excited about because I've always been enjoying these type of games where you are actually taking care of creatures, you're doing a little bit of uh, creature collecting, and while you're doing that, you're also taking care of the plan or the world you're exploring. This is going to be just that, and I'm super, super excited to play it. So without further ado, guys, before we jump into this one, just want to take the opportunity here to thank the publisher for providing a review copy of the game with you all. If you guys are interested in the game, go on and grab it for yourselves. Links down below in the description. The game is available right now. I just have my hands on the copy here of the game a little bit early. So uh, stay tuned for a couple of episodes coming out for the next few days now. And now, uh, without further ado, let us dive right in. Let's do this. I'm actually super excited about this one, guys. Brand new games are always something that I'm always, always checking out for. <sighs> Let's just continue with the rescue brief. Wait. Wait, what's happening? Wrong. Oh, what the heck? Brace for impact! Brace for impact! And of course, we're gonna crash land on Ava. Ava being the name of the planet, of course, not the character we're playing as. Oh gosh. This is bad. Oh wait, we were not alone! Oh, actually no, I think I know what's happening here. This spaceship was in space, and I got ejected, right, out of a uh, capsule. That's how I made my way to Ava. Oh, no way. No, my parents! What? How is the game starting so... Oh my gosh, I did not expect this. What? Wow, I did not expect this. <laughs> so apparently we were on a really giant spaceship. Or more like a colony in space. Oh my god, it blew up. No, uh, seriously. What happened? But I eventually got ejected, right? And I guess I made my way to um, Ava here. But it looks like it looked like I was much smaller than I am right now in the game. Oh my god, this looks so good! What the? Tabitha, are you there? Um, guys, this looks so good. Look at the graphics. Holy smokes! Uh, I'm gonna be honest, I did not play the demo of this one, I just did not have a chance to play the demo, but oh my gosh, this looks so special. Um, I'm gonna absolutely love this game. I already know it. Uh, so my mission is to heal myself, apparently. Hold up. Let me grab this one. Healing brew, press up. Oh, that is so good! That's better. Tabitha, Man. I'm alive, but our field equipment is... It's, it's... Tabitha? Do you read? I, I gotta head to higher ground because Tabitha cannot hear me apparently. Maybe if I get some height. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man, but the graphics of the game looks absolutely spectacular. Of course, I'm playing this game on all high resolution, everything at the max. And uh, I am loving the look of this. And not only that, but the game itself actually feels pretty smooth. I like this. I really enjoy this. The movement is very, very smooth as well, though. And that is really important in these type of video games. I'm gonna have a, a lot of wildlife to discover. So I guess I gotta go even higher than this. I think I can use another health potion to heal myself again. Ah, there we go. Okay, we are fully healed. Uh, that's how you crouch. This is so good. It does kind of like have a little bit of a uh, Paleo vibe to it. But it looks much better than Paleo. Uh, I also got a sprint apparently. Wait, how do you sprint? Oh, like this, okay. There we go. Oh, look at that creature! Wait, I just discovered the creature, apparently. Uh... What is it called? I don't know. A crash. Of course, I haven't really done any... Anything with it, so I have no idea... How to explore it, but oh my god, the vegetation! I'm absolutely loving this art style. I've been seeing a lot of games lately using this art style. 
And I'm in love with this. This just looks very spectacular. Wait. What's up with these creatures? Huh. Look at this. So many artifacts and everything. It's awesome. Crouch in tall grass to hide. Oh, okay, so we're hiding in this tall grass. I get it. Okay, okay, okay. I'm guessing we're going to need this uh, technique in order to be able to kind of like sneak around behind creatures. And stealthily get close to them. In order to maybe uh, scan them. Crouch to hide. What am I hiding from? The thing is, as I was saying, guys, this is a creature collecting game, right? So, uh, there's gonna be a lot of creatures we're gonna have to identify. Look at the world, though. This looks so good. Again, as I was saying at the beginning of the video, guys, the game is brand new. It's just been released. And look at those guys. It's a whole pack. I can't miss this chance. Wait, what am I about to do? Take a photo? Or scan. We gotta scan them, right? How do I scan them? Oh, camera. There we go. So I'm guessing we're using the camera to scan them. Uh, press right to equip the camera up to zoom in and RB to take a photo. Oh, never mind. We're just taking a photo, I guess. No, I didn't. Dang it. I did not want to kill myself. Oh, photo shoot time. <laughs> Look at his face. Man, but the graphics are just so good. I love it. Look at this. Oh, what the heck was that? Not I did not really like the sound of that. Is it? Yeah, that was very loud. I cannot wait to see how the combat works in this game, to be honest. Uh, because although this game is kind of like a peaceful game, it does have combat. Uh, as I'm going to have to fight some uh, creatures that I'm eventually going to have to tame. Uh, I was just going here, thinking that there might be some secrets for us. Uh, but I'm not seeing anything. Of course, this this game is also going to be scattered with secrets. I'm 100% sure about it. Uh, so it's going to be my job here to try to find them, identify them, and uh, make, be, make a guy for you guys. Ooh. See a little bit of a... Actually, I think that's where I landed. Might be, yeah. Hey, we got some health packs. Grab the stems. There we go. I wasted one, unfortunately. Oh, look at those creatures. Hold up, hold up. Can I take a photo of them? Hey, you can. <laughs> look at their faces. <laughs> what a beautiful creature. An uhl. Blah. Can break ropes. Lower bridges. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. So if I go for the menu here, we got the Apedia, right? So these are the ones that we explore. We got the O-Hall and the Kraj. Now, complete three research tasks. So I got to do some tasks with them. New information. Uh, in order to kind of like uh, complete it 100%, right? Because I, I see that I have one out of nine uh, completed. So I took a photo of it, but I also have to take a photo of an infected crash. We got to pet one. We got to use a crash, cooperability, And we got to cure the crash infection. And that's when I'm going to be probably completed. That is so cool. I cannot wait to play this game some more. Keep on exploring and keep on finding up some more stuff. And of course, I'm saying I cannot wait to play while I'm actually playing. Sorry, guys. I'm just excited, okay? Press to equip the camera. I, I mean, I already did that. I already scanned these ones. What a beautiful creature. <laughs> Those faces, though. What the heck? Uh, they're awesome. Replace. All right, that's so much a better uh, photo. Hey, those guys again. Okay. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> oh, this has those ears, though. What the heck is that? Uh, am I just about to enter the first combat scene? Um... Hello? Oh, I think we crashed down. Wait, what? 
I think this is one of the villagers. We already know that this uh, this planet is gonna have some inhabitants, not just the, the uh, creatures. Need some help? Ooh, he speaks my language. What? Huh? Tell me what broken the legs? It's the legs, isn't it? Wait, what? No, I'm fine. I I just huh? hang on. You speak my language? You're not the first human to follow Ava. Always breaking their legs. Very sad. What? No, listen. My legs are fine. Strong legs. Good legs. <laughs> if you say so. Uh, what are you doing here on Ava? Oh. Strong legs. Huh. I'm here to rescue you, and that's not my. Wait, what? You're here to rescue me? Yeah. You just <laughs> fell down a big hole. <laughs> okay, but listen. And now you're trapped in a ruin because your rubble covered the exit. Hmm. Correct, but and all your legs are fully broken. They're not. Well, I think they're rescuing the wrong person. I'm not rescuing only you, whoever you are. The infection. We're trying to preserve the whole, uh, the entire... Uh, never mind. Whatever you say, strong legs. <laughs> Wait, forget about me. Uh, what are you doing down here? Oh, be looking for something. It's, um, you know what? It doesn't matter. Huh? Yeah, got a feeling I won't have to search for much longer. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. Well, whatever the reason, we're both stuck. But I'm going to get us out of here, okay? Somehow. Let me look around. Hey, there we go. Antares Cliff Temple. This is so cool, though. Look at this creature. This character, actually, not creature. Can I... Can I scan him? I guess I can. Let me take a photo. There we go. Identified. The Nimar. So these are the inhabitants of this area. And I'm, I'm noticing that every single time we're scanning stuff, we're also getting kind of like some XP or whatever that is. All right, let's see what this temple is all about. The images I've seen do not convey the smell. Oh, gosh. Can I scan it? It doesn't look like I can scan it, though. I can take a photo, but it's not doing anything by looks of it because you cannot scan it. All right. Um, let me figure this out. Hold up, let me chat with him for a second. Can I ask his name? What is this place? It's a ruin. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know, but what kind of... Uh, didn't you say you wanted oh. to look around, book about, maybe touch some old objects and stuff? Mm -hmm. No? Right. Uh, how do you speak my language so well? Oh. Well, they make it sound like it's difficult. <gasps> Wait, what? But I forgot how much uh, you humans love to get distracted the way out. Huh. Right, of course. <laughs> oh, man. Come on, buddy. I'm just curious. Ooh, this kind of looks like a uh, something I'm going to be able to break. Or maybe this fell out from the top? No. Interesting. We got to get cleared out. Oh, I think I can jump up here. Oh, you can! Hey, hey, we're doing a little bit of a lot of crafting here. Very strange place for sure. And I feel like we might be able to climb up top here. Ooh, we can. Okay, this is cool. Haven't really found any secrets, like secret chests or anything like that, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna start coming up on these type of objects very soon. But now, let's see what this is. Am I just about to leave him there? Wait, wait, what? Whoa, this thing still works? Apparently it does. But apparently I'm going deeper though. Whoa. This game looks awesome. This one doesn't work, though. I'm actually really loving the world they built here, and I think I'm just about to get my hands on some sort of a weapon. Is that like a staff? What is this? Get it. Oh, the infection! What the heck? I guess I gotta figure out how to use it to get rid of the infection. Man. What? The graphics of this game are just so good. So good. The game feels very polished, and that's what I love about it. I knew it. Hmm, you humans can't help yourselves. Huh? Excuse me? Huh? You found it, and you just plucked it up? No questions asked. Amazing. <laughs> you mean this staff? Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't know. Haha. <laughs> Don't let it ruffle you, strong legs. Huh? The Nafitar is what I've been looking for. It's an ancient relic. Are you some kind of a... That's right. I'm... 
an archaeologist. Huh. Hmm. Well, you'll want this. Uh, enough it's are of yours then, huh? Oh, no, 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 no. That's okay. You keep it. You're the antique collector. I can carry an old stick around all day. Well, that old stick is going to get us out of here, of course. Use your brain, strong legs. See that blister over there? The withering is blocking our way. The Nafitar was made eons ago by the Antares. And the Antares, well, they had ways to cleanse the witherings. We just need to learn how. Here we go. So we got ourselves, uh, our hands on the Nafitar. Apparently the Nafitar is the tool that I'm going to be using in order to clear the infection uh, on this entire planet. So, the way you're going to do it is aim and shoot. Oh, the might. Just aim and it's doing its thing. It works. Keep going. <laughs> I'm loving the voices, Zell. Voice acting is awesome. What did you call the infection? The... The withering. Oh. Hmm. name for something that's killing the planet. Yeah, well, not oh. everyone thinks that way. But yeah, the name makes sense to me too. These ancient beings you mentioned. The Antares. I've been studying them my whole life. So these Antares, they were an advanced civilization? Well, you mm -hmm. might say that. Uh, most Nam would say that they were a... Uh, th uh, thoughtless? I have my own theories, though. What even mm -hmm. is this Nefitar? How does it work? Well, that's what I would love to find out. Maybe if we... Mm, you know what? Never mind. Ignore my ramblings for now. Everyone else does. Alright, but... I do want to learn his name, though. Oh, what? That is really cool, though. I've always really enjoyed these type of games where you gotta kind of like clean up or cleanse up the planets that you're exploring or the world you're exploring. And this is doing exactly that. And I love it. It's so good. All right, hold up. We gotta cleanse this one as well. And it's complete. Awesome. Uh, investigate the nearby chamber, which I'm guessing is this one right over here that I'm gonna jump into. I'm not seeing any stamina, so I guess you can sprint for as long as you want. Clean this up. I think, yeah, these are all holding into the middle here. So I gotta cleanse a couple of them to eventually be able to explore this stuff. There we go. Hey, Ooh. uh, Mr. Archaeologist? You're gonna wanna see this. The voice acting of the main character is really good. I love it. Through stone we teach. Uh, what? The ancient Ataris built these all over Ava. It's a sage stone. See the inscriptions? Through stone we teach. Hmm. Is there a language you don't speak? You don't know much about us now, do you? Put the Nafitar into that slot. Go on, trust me. <laughs> there it is. Oh, wait, Adventist what? Taurus mosaic, but it's fractured. Maybe we can. That's it. Keep working on it. Um, this one is supposed to be here somewhere. How do I? Change the piece. There we go. I needed another one. Oh, we can also rotate it. Hold up. How do we rotate? Like that. This one's going to go here. Uh, this one is at the bottom here. This one needs to be rotated like that. Love it. We're also going to have some puzzling to do. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. It's like a group of those Antares people you love so much. But do you know what's happening here? It's a funeral. The Antares buried their loved ones in the soil. But hmm. for each body... They uprooted the tree. Then they made these trees float above the grave as a marker. You're saying their gravestones were floating trees? Are you surprised? Few humans have your magic. The Antares had theirs. And I think we just got some of it. The voice acting of the main character is really good. The character, though, that we're talking to, the archaeologist, mm, mm, not that good, unfortunately. Uh, also levitates all oh, weather creatures from the ground for some time, making them unable to move or attack. It can also levitate certain objects in the environment. So cool. He has the power. You need to connect a withering entire, uh, the entity. Stone, so this one. They use the word Ushun, which in your language would be levitate. 
So, strong legs. Try to ushun. Try to levitate something with the nafitar. Alright, alright. Hold up, hold up. How do you levitate, though? How do you move it? Uh, RB? No, RB. Ah, there we go. That is cool. Mm. The effect is temporary. Still, this new ability might help us find a way out. All right, right. So, we can move things around by the looks of it, right? That's the thing that we just moved away. Wait, can I move this one as well? Oh, this is just allowing me to go back in. Okay, never mind. I don't want to do that. That's cool. Yeah, I saw there's another one there, buddy. Where are you going? Oh, he wants me to go this way. Okay, in that case, let me do this and this. Let me do this. All right, that one's cleansed up. And I need to get to the other one as well, right? But in order to do that, I need to first of all climb up here. So. I'm pretty sure I can activate it from up top, right? Pretty sure it's gonna work. Like this, this. Now you can jump. That is so cool. Love it. Now do that and do. Can I reach it? There we go. There we go. Alright, buddy. Path is cleared. No, really. What is this thing? The Nafitar? Well, the truth is, I'm not sure, but it's powerful, right? Remarkable. Ingenious, even. Just think. It might even... Uh, excuse me. I'm getting overexcited. You do seem very into this stuff. These Antares, they had a lot of these devices? Well, it's unlikely, but I don't know. There are big gaps in my uh, understanding of the Antares. Yeah? Well, you seem to know a lot. That's what happens when you get obsessed with an ancient civilization so young, I guess. I hear that. For me, it was critters. Nah, well, you'll find plenty of those on Ava. You explore these ruins alone? Aren't you afraid of the infection? Oh, I am worried of the withering, alright? The real trouble is most Nam won't go too deep into the Antares ruins. I'm an enthusiast. I work alone a lot. Hmm. Oh, well, same. Alright, I guess you gotta follow me, buddy. Because I found a way to get out of here. Uh, that crash down there. It's in pain. <laughs> It is trapped by withering. Soon it will be a withered one. Crazed, no, 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 no. Impressive. Perhaps we should. Human. Oh, what the? Oh, that's an effective one. Hold up. Dash and jump. Dash and jump to remain mobile during dangerous encounters. These actions cost stamina. Oh, okay, so there is going to be stamina. Never mind. Oh! Calm down. <laughs> Calm down. There we go, we took the photo. Ooh. Okay, so you can kind of like fight with it. So this is kind of like the combat, right? We're not really defeating the enemies or more like the creatures. We're just, oh gosh. Uh, we're just trying to get rid of the withering from them. That's all we're doing, basically. Hey, get over here. And whenever you're using the the device on them, you're also kind of like attaching to them, right? Oh, you can attach to multiple. With the entities that collide with the beam are automatically chained to the absorption. Ah, that is good. Oh shoot, there's multiple. Oh, there's so many of them. Hold up, let me get some health. Okay, so now we're chaining them basically. Take it, why don't you jump? Come on! I get. It's not that easy though, to be honest. There we go. Finally. And next. Oh wait! I gotta save this one. How do I save him? Help. Shh. Easy. What are you doing, human? These creatures are why I'm here. You're here to save 
The Krage? I told you. I'm here to save... Every creature, not just the Krage. Oh man, we're gonna be able to pet him. <laughs> no, don't go away. Wait, I wanted to pet you. Dang it. Well, well. Looks like we found our way out of here. So, Mr. Archaeologist, what do they call you? Let's see. In your tongue, my name is... What is it in Nam? Oh, Nimar. I'm Nimar. Hey, there we go. So this is basically going to be their own town we're going to be able to also explore. That's awesome. I'm loving Creatures of Ava so far. The look of it, the feel of it is really good. Uh, one thing that I would have preferred would be the mouth movement to be a bit better. The animation, I mean. Can you hear me? Hey, Vic, finally! Tabitha! Vic, I'm tracking your PDA, but I can't hear you. Your microphone. Damn radio? She's right. Vic, I uploaded coordinates to your map. Stick to the plan. Go to the old Aleph Prime base and reactivate the teleporter there. Right. Stick to the plan. God, I hope she's hearing me. Get that old teleporter working, Vic. Get that old teleporter working. The human base she's talking about, do you know what it is? Sure, but listen, human, you can't just go jogging up to the old sack. Wait, what? Why? Is it dangerous? Guarded by some fierce creatures? Um, well, in the matter of speaking, yes. They are called Honlo, chief nam of the village that sits between us and the base. Oh, so you're saying... Yeah, if a human is walking around on Ava again, the chief would want to know why. You better meet. Who knows? Maybe Honlo will like you? Hmm, let's go. Alright, buddy. So his name is Nimar. That is awesome. Come, uh, come in, Tabitha. So basically, we gotta follow Nimar now. Uh, he's probably gonna take me in town, right? I wanted to see that creature that we just saved. Oh, living quest area. Wait, what? I'm not leaving quest area. How do you hold up? How do you check the map? If I press down, nothing happens. Uh, oh, there we go. There's the map. So you can kind of like see a little bit of the map. Turn on upgrades. Antares statues. Centaurus and wind chimes. So there are going to be a lot of secrets hiding in the game that I'm going to want to explore, of course, and find. Uh, this one is basically the Tamora Grasslands, where I'm going to be able to look for all these things. I wonder if um, I got to take photo of these things that I'm trying to explore. Or how do you discover them? Oh, hey, I just found something. Plants allow you to craft useful consumables. I should have taken a photo of that, to be honest. Should have definitely taken a photo of that. Uh, next time, I'm definitely going to take a photo of it so that I can add some more DXP to my inventory. And look at that. We got a something here. Health booster. Can I take a photo of that? Oh, shoot. Oh, I cannot take a photo of that, actually. But yeah, this game is going to be about exploration, right? Meaning I'm going to have to take a photo of a lot of things. Not to mention the game is going to be full of secrets. Look at that. And there's another one here as well. Can I take a photo of it? Okay, so you cannot take a photo of the um, the plants. I mean, you can, right? But it, because it's not marking it down, it, it's not going to give me anything. Plant discovered. So we got plants. We got the rose arms and lutchers. Uh, can I take a photo of this? No. All right, hold up, Nimar. I'm just, uh, I'm just exploring, buddy. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Look at him. I do want to try to get close to those ones eventually and pet them. This world, though. Look at this town. Just so colorful and pretty. What? Another creature discovered. Look at this. Hey. Can you please look at me? I want to take a photo. Hey, look up. <laughs> look up. I have a feeling I'm going to be able to use these creatures to maybe uh, traverse a little bit faster. Ooh, ooh. Dang it, it didn't look up enough. Healthy. Okay. So when you're taking photos, you can kind of like also analyze them to uh, figure out if they are healthy and if they need your help or not. This is really pretty though. There we go. And replace. Perfect. Uh, I also see another plant over here. 
Can I take a photo of it? I would like to take that plan, but apparently I cannot. That is so cool that this guy is actually playing the way uh, the flout and we can listen to him. Character unlocked. So many characters are back here. I want to take a photo of that one as well. I just want to take a photo of everything. I have a feeling they haven't seen a human in a long, long time. And this one is the chieftain. Greetings, Nimar. We see a human? Hi. Mm -hmm. I'm here to help. Well, we speak to Nimar, yet the other one answers. Typical humans. Hello, why are you returning to Ava? I have a return. This is my first time. Listen, we're here to save Ava's life form. The infection, the withering you call it, right? It can't be stopped. Your planet. Hmm. Your planet is dying. Hmm. Mm -hmm. We have a bio arc in orbit. We are here to save every creature we can. That includes the Nam. See? Well, that is very ignorant. Excuse me? You've been spending too much time with Nimar. Eva does not need to be saved. Eva does not need a cure. There is nothing wrong. But Chief, with respect. Show us all the respect you like. Until you respect Eva, you won't understand. Uh, well, I'm sorry for intruding. Can you at least point me to the old human base nearby? Is that all you need to get off our planet? Hmm. Well, I still have things to do here, but yeah. If I can't get in touch with my partner, I'll never be able to leave. Then, we help. Talk to, uh, Vietti. They take interest in all human draws. Don't ask why. Vietti will help you. Hmm... Man, this game! Uh, I love it! It is just so good! Hold up. Let me first of all scan the... or take a photo of... the chieftain. There we go. He's been identified. Uh, I've already identified Nimar here. What about you? Unknown. Say cheese. Smiling. Look at that. <laughs> Love it. Can I take a photo of the guards? Yeah, let's take a photo of the guards as well. Wait. Cons. Hi. Hmm. Can break jelly. I don't. I don't want to take a photo of those creatures. I want to take a photo of the guard, but apparently it's it's not allowing me to. Alright, let me chat with him some more. You speak a little different from Nimar. Why is that? It is Nimar who speaks different from us and from all now. Your human chatter is all this word. Me, 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 me. My, my, my. An interesting quirk of your tongue and mind. But for now, there is no me. We recognize ourselves. Oh no, but we are part of Nam. All Nam. We are always we. No doubt this will trouble you. We don't care. Seriously, why do you all seem to speak my language so well? We are not shocked to find another human who does not know their own history. The last humans on Ava brought much material. We spoke to them with pleasure, and they spoke back. I did not take long to learn. How long? A few days. Which now? Wait, what? We have heard such exclamations of surprise before. Mm -hmm. So you're all natural gifted language nerds? The correct term is polyglots. Well, I have to take a word for it. <laughs> you see, your human tongue is lyrical, attentive, flexible, and pleasing. We cannot say the same of its uh, native speakers. Who did you say I was supposed to speak to again? The Vaeti. They are nearby. Human troubles interest Vaeti and we tolerate this. But we will not tolerate everything. Alright, I can take a hint. <laughs> we are the chief's word and you are intriguing. Can I interact with these creatures? Cannot. Man, there are so many things to explore. And because this game, this world that we're exploring right now is very, very colorful, it makes it a little bit tricky, to be honest, <laughs> to uh, spot things that we have to uncover. But uh, I love it, though. I really, really love it. We saw a cloud that resembled a... Haji? A crudge, actually. Can I scan these ones? I have a feeling I'm gonna get my hands on a glider or something to be able to glide all the way from up here, right? Hopefully. 
Yeah, because I see a lot of these perch points. But no way for me to uh, glide down. Alright, uh, let me make my way towards the mission then. It's awesome that the world is so vibrant. So many characters around, especially in this uh, village. So many, look at that. Alright, this one is the Vaeti. Let me take a photo. There we go. Add them up to our collection, I guess. Uh, so we got quite a few characters we explored. The Nam Shepherd. Okay, so those are Shepherds. These are the Nest Word. This one is the Chieftain, of course. This guy is the Explorer. And then there's me. Uh, ah, you're also discovering places. I wonder if I'm supposed to take photo of the places. I don't even know. Excuse me, are you? Human, you're back. I knew you returned for the withering. Excellent news. Did you bring any, uh, we don't remember the words, uh, writing stick? Pens? Pens, yeah, we love them. <laughs> oh no, no pens, sorry. Listen, um, is that a radio? Can we use it? We want to call old earth friends. Uh, you and me both. My radio is busted. But if I can get a human base nearby, mm. hmm, I live prime base. Okay, we know it, we know it. Let us point you to the uh, right direction. Mm. The door is blocked, but there's another way in. You need this tool. Look for the little, um, uh, how do you say it? Uh, the thingy. The little thingy? Right. <laughs> Alright, so apparently, a zipline tool. Ah! So you're gonna be able to use the zipline tool to kind of like traverse the world. That is cool. I think I was supposed to take a photo or scan something here. I think it was kind of working, but I, I don't know what it was trying to scan. To explore the hu abandoned human base. Uh, if I go to the map, okay, it's going to be right over here. Can I put in markers? No. Interesting. I wonder what this is. It looks like I gotta put something in the middle there. So I'm probably gonna have to find some objects and bring the collectibles over here. Man, but the world is scattered with details. There's just so much stuff everywhere. I don't even know what to look for. There's just so much of it. And I think I can hear a charm. And from what I know... A whole Kote Tower. Uh, from what I know, apparently there are quite a couple of charms that we are supposed to collect in the game. And this one... Oh, it's right there! Wait, how do I... Eh. Isn't it this one? It is! There we go! We found it! Gotcha. A wind chime photographed. One skill point. What? I got a skill point for that. And this one is located... Um, I guess right over here. In the whole a whole Kote Tower, I guess? That's how it's called? I love it that you can kind of like hear a sound so you can identify them easier. That is great. Uh, these are the other creatures that we already explored. Uh, give me a second here. So we got inventory. Uh, creatures. These, uh, no, not these ones. These, no, uh, these ones. So we got to take a photo of an infected one. We got to pet one. How do you pet them? Wait, how do you pet the creatures? Hello? Yeah, it's like I can pet them though. Hmm. Interesting. Maybe I gotta increase my relationship with them a little bit more before I'm gonna be able to pet them. Uh, maybe like, save them first. The Eastern Bridge. Another skill point. I'm guessing skill points here are being generated because I'm exploring the world and discovering it, right? That's why we keep on finding more. And I just noticed something over there. I'm guessing these drawings are probably gonna kind of like uh, resemble maybe secret spots that I can find. Ooh, what is that? I cannot scan it, but I will collect it then. <gasps> Wait a minute! I can use my tool to get rid of this. Doesn't seem to work. Yeah, this doesn't work apparently. Interesting. I think I may need to um, make my tool stronger to be able to get rid of these ones. The one that I can get rid of is that one over there. That one is definitely going to work. At the same time, I wonder if there's full damage in the game. I have a feeling there is. And at the same time... 
It's very infected. It is. Don't, don't worry, I'm gonna save you. What is that? So, the infected one that I just discovered, is it this creature? Yes, it is. I think it's the aura, but the infected aura. Yeah, I'm pretty sure about it. Okay. Man, I'm really loving the game, guys. Uh, collected it? Yes, we did. And yes, you guys are gonna keep on hearing me say this, but that is the truth. You guys know that every single time I'm playing a video game, if it is super fun like this one is, I'm always gonna check him out. I mean, look at the, how beautiful this is. Are you kidding me? This is just spectacular. Can I turn the camera around to take a photo? Got like a screenshot. Is there even a screenshot option? Yeah, I'm not seeing a screenshot option anywhere. We got data bank. Hmm. Can I take a photo of this? No. All right. Um, let me go back then. I'm curious if there is any fall damage. I think we are actually going to discover that by simply falling at one point. I wish I could pet these ones as well. I don't know how to pet the creatures. Also, I'm noticing some drawings over here. What is this? There are a lot of things that I still do not know about the game that I'm going to have to discover by simply exploring. And the thing about this game is that it's just so full of life and details that it's just going to take me forever to um, discover everything. Just because I'm a huge sucker for these type of games and I absolutely love exploring them so much. Drinking is essential for good health. I wish I could read these signs. Even the music in the background is super duper well done. Love it. We got the Pelia Finger. Ooh. Oh, these are getting scared off. Dang it. I want to get close to them. I have a feeling in order to get close to the creatures, I may need some specific um, tools. Maybe like a whistle or something like that. That I could use to sing to them. Oh, wait. Climb. Oh, I can climb down. Never mind. Okay. Let me collect more. We are going to need these things that I keep on collecting, to be honest, at one point. But now, let me keep on making my way to the uh, destination that we have here. Well, unfortunately, these creatures are not going to want to let me pet them just yet. But this town is full of life. There's so much. I think I can hear a charm. Oh, I can. Look at that. It's right over there. So this one is at the entrance of the town over here. These look so good. Look at that. Look what we got here. Got another one. Awesome. And if I look at the map. This one is all the way over here at Tamura Grassland Sibling Tree, I guess, right? Climb close to it. I wish you could, like, mark it down. Mark down some uh, locations as well. So currently, the, the wind charms uh, are the only ones that I found that I got to collect. Oh, all things are one with Ava, even the flowers. I am absolutely loving this world. It's just so full of life and colorful. Listen to this one. I think he is the one controlling the animals because he's singing to them. Look at that. Ava, preserve us. Huh. So I feel like, as I was saying, I feel like I'm going to have to get my hands on one of these whistles uh, to be able to do the same thing. That is awesome. Look at that. Take a gallery picture. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to have to uh, learn how to do this. Alright, so. I think this is the human base. 
Definitely feels like it. Can I interact with these crates? How do I get in? I think it. I think you gotta get in through the top somehow. Yep, right through here, I guess. It's really, really destroyed, though. The Aleph Prime's grassland base. What is that? Oh, activate the zipline. What? What zipline? Uh, hello? Whoa. That is so cool. So I'm guessing I can use this one to climb back up. At the same time... Can I open up this door? Uh, but I can use this to get out if I want to. Okay. That is awesome. Uh, needs power. Okay, so we cannot use that one. Let me collect some more plants here. I think a lot of resources by the looks of it. Don't really know exactly what I'm going to do with them just yet. But I will soon. Wait, can I connect to those creatures? No. Probably we don't know how to do it just yet. Uh, but let's get this one raised up so I can go inside. Go. Okay, this one still needs power to turn on. What is that? A memo from Dr. Margareter. Hmm. Michael, I hope you brought your hiking boots, my young friend, because this planet re requires some real rambling. Management has me on the teleporter setup and zipline duty. You'll find the stations I've set up all over the place, along with some ziplines to help with, mountain, uh, with mountainous areas and such. I doubt our colleague, Dr. Kravitas, will make much use of them. Uh, the man barely leaves his lab. Anyway, be careful out there, okay? And remember, treat the now with respect. After all, we're guests here. Interesting. I'm guessing there's going to be quite a lot of these memos I'm going to have to collect, right? This is the first one that we have got. Uh, we got more plants unlocked over here as well. I'm going to have to figure out what I'm going to be able to do with them. Okay. Not to mention, we got more locations that we're unlocking. So I'm definitely going to have to find every single one of them. And I think there is one more location in the village that I got unlocked here. Then we're going to be able to uh, find more, maybe. The more you explore, of course, the more you find. Uh, we got the Nafitar here, we got the tree in the air, and then we got the Withering we're going to have to deal with. And of course, these are all the uh, characters that we find around. Shaman of the Jira. I think. Alright, hold up, the power is not on yet. Turn it on. Oh wait, that's a portal! What? This Tab. looks so cool. Oh. This Tabitha. Ah, <laughs> oh, thank God you're okay. When you're single cut out in atmosphere, I'm fine, Tab. Listen, you won't believe what I found. Well, I can see it. What on earth are you carrying around? It can heal the infection, Tab. Hmm, interesting. At what range? Uh, what's the spread? Rate of delivery? Mm -hmm. Well, uh, it travels a few meters and takes a while. It's kind of slow, but... Big, I know what you're thinking, but we're just two people. I don't think we're saving the whole planet with that. You know what your parents would have said, right? Hmm. Of course. Dictate a plan. Speaking hmm. of which, the taming equipment. Hmm, destroyed in the crash, but... Yes? Hmm. It's a long shot, but the local NAM seem to have a strong rapport with the creatures. Maybe one of them might help? Hmm, the NAM? Well, if we're going to start rescuing creatures, then I don't have a better suggestion. Well, I'll go ask my friend about it. Your friend? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do you think helped me get here, huh? <laughs> hey, the songs of Ava. There we go. I think this is where I'm going to start learning the songs of Ava to be able to control the creatures. Uh, so we are going to have to do a little bit of um, exploring about and learning here, of course. Are you staying here? For the time being, yeah. But soon, I'll go set up the post in Nam Village. Good luck. Their chief isn't exactly Gr Gr Gregorius, I guess. And the reason the uh, Nam would dis uh, distrust humans? Well, hmm. when the last Aleph team was here, they were researching, observing. They're bound to have had a few minor quarrels with the Nam, but it's hard to say. You'd think that the chief would uh, forget a grudge after 20 years? 25? But yeah, 
maybe not. So the whole no gender thing. Mm. Yeah, that. Noun physiology is nothing like human beings, and a lot still isn't clear. But mm. basically, there's no he or she on the noun. It's all they. You'll get used to it. Mm. But then, how do they reproduce? Mm. Maybe you could ask them? Politely? <laughs> Yeah, that's um very curious, of course. So we are gonna have to figure that out as well. Can I use the portal? Oh, you can use the teleporter to teleport over here. Can I? No. Uh, this is the quest that I gotta go for. So these are all gonna be the teleporters, right? This is gonna be the, uh, I guess, the icon for them. Can I scan her? Oh yeah, we can. Okay. Hey, come on for the camera, will ya? <laughs> Here we go. That's a better picture. Uh, replace. Awesome. All right. And now we can explore through this. Here we go. Uh, okay, I want to find out if there's fall damage. That's not enough to fall down. These switches are going to get scared of me, of course. And there are the ones that I'm going to have to tame. I wonder if I am capable to tame them, to be honest, because it might not be that easy. Oh, gosh. Okay. I'm taming all of them now. Which is great. Don't go too far, though. Oh, shoot. We're good. We're good. We're doing it. Almost done. Hey, we got them both. Awesome. I wish I could pet him, but I think in order to do that, I may just need to get myself a, um, a whistle, right? So, let me make my way towards the mission. Then we're going to carry out... Whoa, what are these? Oh, these are the infected ones. Are they? I don't even know. Oh, shoot! Oh, come what? on. I want to help you. Hmm. They're not infected, though. Why are they attacking me? Oh, gosh. Get out of there. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to fight them for sure. All right, let's see. Uh, got to go this way for the mission. I got to climb back up, I guess, right? And, of course, I noticed the location over there that I got to cleanse up. I'm not going to focus on that yet. Hmm, I got to figure out what these wrongs are. Uh, because at the moment, I want to figure out how to pet and uh, tame those creatures. Hold up, let me grab this. And these two. And I'm going to have to uh, keep my ears open, because there's definitely going to be more of those uh, charms around here that I got to take photos of. Wait. Is that a grave? It is. Wait a minute. I, don't, I got no clue how to read it, though. Yeah, I cannot interact with it. Never mind. Thought I could. Oh, there you are. You are. Found your human friends? Strong legs? Hmm. You're dead. Huh. Hey, weird question. Do you know any good shepherds? <laughs> That's not a weird question. And yes, I know Shep team. Uh, they live in the hills. Great. Gotta go. I got a job offer for them. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Take this. A flute. Thank you. Oh. Numb shepherds are a bit of love. Uh, to get their attention, oh. sometimes uh, you will have to do a little... Uh, you will have to be a little creative, I guess. Just and we got ourselves a flute. And you wanna, if you want to play the flute... Ah, uh, what? Man, this reminds me a lot of... Um, Chia and the guitar, right? But here we're playing a flute. That is so cool. Oh man, this is epic. Uh, I'm gonna love this for sure. All right, we got this one though. Uh, what am I supposed to do next? I'm supposed to go. Oh gosh, all the way up here. The song of Ava. Find Shepti, the shepherd. All right, let's head on now then. Alright, so I made my way all the way to the top here. This is where I found the first one. 
Um, but our path is taking us all the way to this other side over here. As I was saying, guys, this is a very, very special adventure. It's going to take me a while to find everything there is in this game because apparently this world is pretty giant. And I'm already lost, to be honest. We got a stamina drink. Interesting. I think down is for stamina and up is for health. Can I collect this flower as well? Hey, we just did. Awesome. We got another one. This one is the Linda Jar. Uh, I wonder if I gotta go through here. Because I cannot interact with this one. Uh, let me take a photo of it first. Oh, I cannot. Hmm. The thing is, this one is different. Much more complex to work with. This doesn't work, though. Hmm. Uh, let me get my health back up. All the way to the top. Apparently, I have no more health, so that's going to be an issue. I'm going to have to find more potions here. These two creatures again. Oh, that guy's to the top. But there's also something at the bottom here that I want to check out. And health. Awesome. More drawings. At least what I love about it is that we're not consuming stamina when we're sprinting. A lot of video games, of course, do have this. Consuming stamina when you're sprinting. Apparently, Creatures of Ava here does not have that. It's not needed because the world is very giant and we're going to have a lot of exploration to do. I think this is where I'm going to learn how to tame these creatures. Pretty sure about it. Hey, bud. Let me take a photo of him. To identify him as well. There we go. Uh, I'm going to leave him the way it is. Talk. Uh, Shepty? Excuse me, are you... Hmm. What was it name said? Be creative? Oh! Be creative! How do I... <laughs> what is that noise? <laughs> Vic, pleased to meet ya. Shepty? So, the human is back. Please do us a favor and don't breathe into the flute ever again. Ugh, harsh. Look, Shepty, my friend and I need a shepherd. Huh. We want someone to guide creatures into our... The creatures of Ava trust only its songs, and a shepherd trusts only in the creatures. Do you understand, human? Hmm. Alright, well, guess I'll just walk around then, playing random notes on this flute then. Bye! Wait, wait! <clears throat> Cut human, there is no need for us to quarrel. Maybe we can help after all? Hmm. Great, come with me and we'll... Most humans are subdued by their own minds. Mm -hmm. Um, if it could... It is a clamor that draws all else, uh, the din of their thoughts, their worries, their past. The flute, take it in your hands, calm the tumult of your mind, and learn the notes of the soul. I have a feeling creatures are gonna kinda like require specific types of song, right? So this one is gonna be D, F. Much better. Understand, every part of Ava has its song, jungle, swamp, and dunes. The tune you just learned is the song of grass. The creatures of the grasslands will now speak to you. But to, but to earn their trust, human, you must learn to speak back. Hmm. So I guess it's going to be my mission to try to uh, tame that creature up ahead. Song of the grass. Tame the nearby Ura. And after that, she's probably going to be used in order to get rid of this, yeah. All right, let me see how I can do this. Taming creatures. Tame wild creatures by intimidating, by imitating the sound they make with their flute. Getting too close to the creatures will scare them. The creature is singing. The creature is waiting for you to repeat the song. And the creature didn't understand. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. 
Okay, hold up, hold up. Hey, we did it! No way! A creature discovered. Pet. No way! You can pet creatures in the game. That is so good. <laughs> Love it. All right. So what next? Ah, I think I can get him to follow me. Yes. That is so cool. And I gotta bring it here. The Ura trusts you. How are you feeling? Well, I, I feel strange, lightheaded, focused, but calm, I guess. Breathe. Feel your feet on the soil. This next part may not feel natural to you. That is because this next part is gonna be where I'm gonna be able to control. Feel Ava. See Ava. As the creatures see Ava. Ooh, that voice acting was really good. Uh, what do I do? Ava Vision. Wait, what? Oh, what? Oh, I'm supposed to control it. Some attacks are extremely powerful and cause heavy damage. <gasps> we can connect to it? What? Oh my god, we can play with the creature. Ava Connect. The creature of Ava can be used to overcome various obstacles. Each creature has its own speciality. Try using the aura to break into nearby fungi barrier and lead the creature to its paddock. No way, guys. No way! No! The aura controls itself. You only feel its sense of being as your own. But we of Ava help one another. Often, our desires align. Hold up! My headphones turned off. All right, and we're back. Now, how do I... Oh, we got to charge it like this. Oh, that is so good. So I'm guessing every single one of the creatures that we're going to be uh, taming is going to have its own abilities. We have taught all we can. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, you have no idea how useful this will be. Well, we are just glad your music has improved. And remember, Ava's song, the notes are beautiful, but the song is born from the from the rest between the notes. Now, uh, go away. <laughs> oh, that was so special, guys. Hey, Tom. Things are finally looking up. Anam agreed to corral creatures for us. Better. They taught me to do it myself. With music. What? <laughs> I'm a regular Pied Piper now. <laughs> You're crazy is what you are. But look, if it works, then whatever. I've dispatched the first set of rescue bots. Try leading some creatures into the bot's capture perimeter. A test to see if they're working. You know how cheap these things are. Man. That is awesome. So our next mission is going to be to find the rescue boat. Uh, but before I do that, I wanted to check on this creature, the aura. So, we... Wait, I did pet an aura. Why, is it, why didn't that count? Uh, maybe I got to go inside and pet it? Hmm, maybe it just didn't count because um, I was in the mission, right? So you, could, uh, you also have the infected one. Uh, use aura cooperability. I already kind of like try to do that. Use aura infection or cure it. I've already done kind of like a little bit of this, but I see that I've done two. So I got to do six and then I got to do 12. Yeah. And for the aura cooperability, I only did it once. I got to do it seven times to kind of like complete everything. There's a lot of stuff you got to do in the game. But can I pet him? How do I pet him? Yeah, it doesn't look like I can interact with these ones. That's probably because they are inside, right? Uh, but I'm going to be able to do it eventually. But anyway, guys, that being said, this game is called Creatures of Ava. This has been my first hour experience with the game. And uh, guys, I might have just found myself one of my favorite games to play in 2024. This is just absolutely stunning. And I'm going to have a blast with this game for the next few days now. So that being said, guys, if you guys enjoyed this and uh, are excited for the next episode, make sure you leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel because I'm brand new here. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, everybody.